Good afternoon, May. It is Friday, and as you can see, I'm wearing contact lenses. Or am I? You'll never know, really. But I am wearing contact lenses, as proof. Here is the thing. Here's the case for them. Here is a bottle to show that it's a thing. So I do apologise very quickly if you're like, Oh, Kurt, you're not wearing glasses. That's weird. Just deal with it for now. Can you just deal with it for now, okay? This is who I want to be, May. Why don't you want me to be happy? Why don't you want me to be happy, do? But as you said yesterday, I did watch Star Wars, as have you, and as as you did say, I thought it was so good. It was so it was so good. It was so good. And yesterday you gave your non spoiler review very quickly about it, and I pretty much agree with everything that you said, and I feel as though I should do my own little non spoilery thing. And then if you want to, you can do your own little spoiler re review tomorrow. And then on Monday, I can do my do, and that way we'll be like, oh my gosh, we're like Star Wars, no? Um, also, why have you gave me the worst punishment? And this is, a, I think this is the worst punishment you've ever given me. Like, it's worse than the, pep than the chili pepper one, it's worse than the a cappella one, it's. It's just like, you're just ruining my life, mate. You ruin It's worse than Reddit 50-50. I'd rather do Reddit 50-50 than watch Star Wars and give a list as to why Jar Jar Binks is good, okay? I can't even think of three, okay? I can't even think of three. I thought of two. I got two already, like, oh, yeah, you did this. But you're ruining my life? Why are you doing this? You, you, you are, like, why? Why? I'm just going to quickly check what time it is. We've got two minutes. We've got two minutes, that's fine. At this point, I'd be like, oh crap, I'm going to wrap things up now. But pretty much, I don't know if you can see me. There's loads of stuff in the way. Um, but overall, I thought that, you know, The Force Awakens' this brand new Star Wars film was absolutely brilliant. Like, you know, it brought it back to what the original trilogy was. For me, anyway, like, you know, the things that were important for me were like, you know, episodes four to six were like, you know, the characters. Um, like, the story in this wasn't really, like, the point, I think, uh, but it does mirror bits which you would have seen before in another Star Wars film. But, again, I think it was about introducing the characters because, you know, we've got Finn and Rey now, and we, like, you know, they needed time to develop those two and have us, like, actually like them, which I do. I think they're brilliant. I love BB-8 as well. I finally remembered his name. And um, I also like the new villains as well. Like, you know, we just Kylo Ren... And from that color, any and overall, I just enjoyed it. I do think, at least until episode eight and nine come out, because we don't know what that is yet. I do think this is one going to be one of the biggest films of the decade. So take that as it is. May. I'm going to quickly check the time again, very quickly. We have less than forty seconds. Okay. So May, basically, I want to ask you now, what like. If there's like, any spoilers you want to go into, then I'm going to ask you if you want, if you can do that tomorrow. So, obviously, guys, if you haven't watched Star Wars yet, me and May are telling you right now, go see it. It's brilliant. And tomorrow, May's going to talk about some spoilery bits if he wants to. And then on Monday, I'm going to talk about some spoilery bits as well, what I thought. But that's it for me. May, hopefully you have a great day. And I shall see you tomorrow. Goodbye.